that's two be toys. Do you know the two be toys out of this world? Hey guys, it's Tiffany from Tubi Toys, and today I have like a weird video. I don't know. I just wanted to like look at all of my, or look at all of our Elastigirl toys that are like stretchy and compare it to this guy right here. Stretch Armstrong. I don't know what it is. I mean, I love stretching him and stuff, but like I know that Elastigirl's pretty stretchy. So I just wanted to like compare like all of them. I have a lot of stretchy Elastigirl toys and I just got a new one from the Disney store and she has like super stretching power and she kind of like reminds me of like Stretch Armstrong. She's not as bulky but I wanted to like unbox her and just like show you guys and let's see you know if you like stretchy toys let's see which one is good for you. I actually also have some figures that are like stationary. I don't know why I just put them on the table. I don't know, I'm feeling a little weird tonight. But <laughs> let's get this party started. Let's start stretching. Also, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and please subscribe to Tubi Toys if you haven't already. And don't forget to ring that notification bell. When you ring that bell, every time I post a new video or a giveaway, you'll be the first to get notified. So let's take a look at all of our stretchy Elastigirl figures. This is from the Power Couple set. This is the set where Mr. Incredible uses Elastigirl as a slingshot and she is like so wobbly and yes she is like one of those like dancing um dancing balloon power like air powered things that like are in front of like stores for grand openings it's awesome she is like pretty cool she is like the stretchiest her waist like thins out like so much she's pretty stretchy and her head is like had like this like hard ball inside like I'm sure if somebody like cut it open you would see something really really weird but I think she's really awesome she's pretty much the stretchiest one then we have this one by J also by Jack specific that other one was also and she actually comes apart from her from her hips she's like a whole hip replacement but she is so stretchy in the arms as well and she sticks to like glass, like windows and stuff like that. She has like little suction cups. So she could be like Elastigirl slash like Spider Girl. So um, she's really cool. But her head is solid and it spins around. This is not a stretchy toy. This is actually from The Incredibles uh, 1. I just put that out there because her arm is a little extended. She kind of reminded me of the Jack Specific uh, minifigure blind boxes. This one's not, ooh, this one's not stretchy at all. This is the baby's toy. This is actually by Lamaze. I haven't done like a full review on these. I do have like a blog post on them. I should do a video because these are actually really, really good if you're a big Disney Pixar fan and you want to get your baby into it too. This is really cool because the baby can pull Elastigirl's arm from side to side. Does not stretch, but she does a lot of cool things. Like she's a rattle. And she's also a teether, and he loves biting on this star right here. It's really, really cool. Really nice, soft toy, and very colorful. We have the Incredibles logo here. Some cool, like, geometric um, shapes over here. She has nice embroidery, and she's super soft, and it has that nice crinkly sound that, like, babies love. So he loves this. And I just attach this to, like, my diaper bag or whatever, and it's really easy to bring around there's like a bunch of toys we actually have all of them if you're interested in seeing them maybe if you have a little brother or sister or maybe your son or daughter let me know and I'll just like post a video on them they came out with like a whole line of toys Lamaze Lamaze is also um if you know Tomi Tomi is a toy company that is Lamaze so they came out with a really cool collection of soft toys for babies with the Incredibles too nice license this is actually from the first McDonald's set. This is my favorite McDonald's toy because of this. And because of this. Look at this. It's like the most perfect stretch. And you can feel like the tug. So you're not like, you don't feel like you're gonna rip her or anything. And her arms are bendy. She has like a Gumby type arm. Not as gummy as Gumby, but Look how cool you could shape her. <laughs> mm. 
This is the Lego minifigure from the Underminer. I'm sorry, not the Underminer. This is from the Screen Slaver set. And she, this is not stretchy at all, but it's the same concept as the Lamaze, like baby toys. Like you could pull her arm from side to side to mimic that of an elastic, like a stretching elastic girl arm. Put it down. And just to compare, this is the other Lego minifigure that came from the set with the Underminer, the Bank Heist. And she has two different faces. She's like this. Urgh. And she has a nice face in this one. So she's pretty versatile. This was from the Funko Disney Treasures um, box we got. This was our last month that we got. It was really, really cool that they sent us this. She's not stretchy, just wanted to show you. Okay, this is from the latest McDonald's set. This was such a letdown because it just snaps into place. It's no stretch. It's just, she has, it's just like the, the, the plastic is extended. Total bummer. This is also from the latest um, when, um, Wendy's. This is also from the latest um, McDonald's um, Happy Meal toys. It's really cool that it twists and everything, but again, there's no stretch. It just, it mimics the stretch, but still pretty cool. It's kind of bendy. Okay, next we have, by Just Play, we have the soft toy. It's a plush. Baby plays with this too, until I discovered this. This really bummed me out. Because of the stretching and everything, the stuffing started to come out and the seam ripped. So the baby will not be playing with it. It's not made for babies anyway, but he really liked it because it's big. And But she has like stretchy arms and you can stretch her legs. And it's a really, really cheap, not cheaply made, but a very well-priced plush doll that does things like does something a little bit extra like the stretching and not the typical like oh let me squeeze it and it talks it's actually a really cool doll and i think it was under 17 dollars on amazon by just play really really cool and really super soft and it has like that really awesome elastigirl shape here we have the Finkway toys elastigirl now yeah she may be like oh she just she just talks no she doesn't just talk she is fully posable. She's posable at the joints of her ankle, her knees. And what's super awesome are her arms. They stretch. They stretch, 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 stretch. They don't do anything. She doesn't make any sounds when she stretches, but let me turn her on so you could hear her. If you haven't watched our video, you should check it out. Hi there. I'm Elastigirl. Girl. Nice to meet you. Time for you and me to catch a bad guy. Are you ready? Are you ready? These arms are really super duper stretchy. And you can hear that clicking. She's really awesome. Especially when she talks to the other family members. Super duper cool. If you have not seen that video, check it out. Really, really good. Now, I'm gonna show you my favorite, favorite figure. This was not a set. This, came, this actually came in a set of the Elasticycle by Jack Pacific. Guys, this is the best one. This is the hidden gem of posable figures by Jack Pacific. Alaska is wearing her dark super suit. This is the new super suit that was specially designed for her to look for bad guys. It has the camera in it. But this was the doll that came with the Alaska cycle. That was the one where you crank it up. We also did a video on that too. This doll is so awesome. I wish they made all of the dolls like her because she is so posable. Like she's like ready for action. The only thing that's not posable are her ankles. But what's super duper cool are her arms. They are so stretchy, guys. Look how stretchy that is. And right now they're molded. It has like, you know, a hole in the hand like to make it seem like she's gonna hold on to something, which she is. She holds onto the handlebars of her elasticycle. But she's really, 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 really posable. Look at that, she's like totally action ready. But what they have her doing on the elastic cycle, she's like kind of like on her stomach and she holds on. She's awesome. It's a bummer that she only comes with that set. I wish they sold her on her own. She's an awesome, awesome, awesome figure. 
Super cool. Let's take a look at the Disney Store one now. This is for ages three and up. I believe this was under $25, oh yeah, $24.95. I actually got it on sale. I can't believe that they actually included it on the sale, but this goes up to 70 centimeters. Oh boy. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I think I have a new favorite. Okay, let's take a look at this box. This box is really, really cool. We have some Spot UV over here, and Spot UV is just like a shiny embossing. It's not exactly raised, but you see that shimmer right there? That makes the box look beautiful. Look at that. It just looks so like old style. It has like that, that old cartoon vibe, like that pop cartoon vibe. I love it. Beautiful graphics on the box. Now the doll. This is, I was going to say, like, is this doll worth it to buy? Absolutely. This is definitely, you must buy this. If you like squishiness, if you like stretchiness, this is the doll. It feels so awesome. It's like one big stress doll. <laughs> but the, what's really cool is that, well, her head, she doesn't turn her head, but it's solid. And look at that. It's I love the detail. They really, really, really did a good job. Um, it says syrup is inside. Okay. <laughs> but she's so squishy. It literally feels like one of those like stress balls. And she has like that. She's softer than Stretch Armstrong. But Stretch, Stretch Armstrong keeps his, his shape when you press down. So let's see who's better. Stretch Armstrong, or any of these Elastigirls that I showed you. We're going to have a stretch off. And let's see if Elastigirl be tied up into a pretzel like a stretch can. Has like he's he's a lot thicker so obviously stretch Armstrong cannot be beaten for stretchiness but if you want Incredibles stretchiness and if you want it to be like stretch Armstrong this is the closest one comparing it to all of the other ones this is too rubbery this is just only part of her body and it's again too rubbery this is just has that right amount of stretch but only in her arms so she could break easily. So this can really, 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 really withstand some hardcore stretching. This can too, of course. This is already just like gonna rip. So Disney Store Elastigirl definitely takes the cake for the ultimate stretchiness and totally compares to Stretch Armstrong. The other ones, not a chance. She holds the press. She's totally squishy. Well, if you like this video, don't forget to give me a thumbs up and please subscribe to To Be Toys. I think this is a pretty stretchy doll. If you, th if, if you agree with me, let me know in the comments below. And if you have this doll, let me know also in the comments below don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and please subscribe to toopy toys thanks for watching guys have a, an incredible stretchy day you know i'm stretchy than elastigirl girl don't even please yes yeah, subscribe don't forget to subscribe
Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, don't forget to subscribe. It's free. Thanks, guys. Have a great day.